Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem for tonight in chapter eleven. In this problem, we look at this system. We have the object, right? And then it hit the earth. And this object's mass and velocity is given. And then where it hit the earth, it is forty-five degrees. So we can get the radius. So we can see the earth is rotated around itself at omega. Omega naught is given. It is.、Uh, One revolution per day. You can convert the unit to radius per second, and then the mass of the Earth is given, and the radius for Earth is given. We need to find, uh, by what factor does this affect the angular velocity for Earth? So for this one, we need to find after the collisions, right? What is the angular velocity? So we can see for these systems, the angular momentum is conserved. Because there is no external force act on this system, right? So we can see first thing we look at is the initial angular velocity. So initial angular velocity we can say it is I omega naught. This is from the earth, the spin of the earth, and also we minus the angular、uh, the m v r sine forty five degree. This is the angular momentum for this object. You can see the object is is R P right. This is R. R sine forty five degree. This is R and M times V is a P momentum. So R P is the angular momentum for this object. And finally, these two sticks together. So we get is we add is I momentum of inertia for the Earth plus this object is momentum momentum of inertia right and then times omega final. Angular velocity. So this one tells us the angular momentum is conserved. And in this equation, you can see the i, the momentum of 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 inertia for the earth. You can check. You can check on your test book. Is this one? And then you input it inside this equation. You can get the function for omega. The function for omega right as this one. Now we need to find what factor does it affect. So we can find the percentage error. So delta omega. Use omega mass, omega naught, omega naught. So you can input the omega inside, input the quantities. You get the final answer. We can say it is super small, so we can ignore it. It is super small. Thank you.